Well, the badge on the back spills the beans. It says four times four and climbing. In a nutshell, it s a soft rotor with front wheel drive doing the work most of the time. But if the front wheels lose traction, a viscous coupling sends driving torque through a prop shaft, rear diff and half shafts to the rear wheels to help out. Providing go is the familiar 1,2 liter single cam engine from the Palio and Sienna models, remapped to provide the same torque, 102 N.M, but peaking at much lower revs, 2,500 as opposed to 3,200, but with maximum output reduced from 54 to only 44 kilowatts. This is a pity, since the extra power would help a lot, especially at inland altitudes. Introduction of the 1,3 liter multi-jet turbines low power plant, as found in the Punto, is possible at a later stage. The styling is an unqualified success, the Panda looking every inch a miniaturized version of some of the larger, well-respected 4x4 stalwarts. While some consider it cute, small add-on black plastic bumper sections and side moldings, including wheel riches and side strips, add a purposeful chunky edge as befits an off-road vehicle. Pandas are made in Fiat S factory in Poland, and the overall standard of finish and paintwork looks very good. Although the standard trekking model, R12400, includes most desirable features such as aircon, key-operated central locking, electric front windows, dual airbags, 